was supposed to be rich a long time ago. I was supposed to be rich a long time ago. I was supposed to be rich in a life. What's up with the tallest big boss? And I'm here with Tasia. Outfit check, outfit check. What you got? Oh, okay. Body soap, fly <laughs> shit, comfortable. Okay, okay. So, um, tell everybody about yourself. Just a little bit. My name is Tasia. I'm fine as fuck. Uh -huh. And I do music and also spoken word and just content creation overall. So. Okay, what's That's your number? What's the number one hobby you doing right now? Like, what's music. your music? Music. <laughs> okay. Um, is there any music that's out right now that they can tune into? Absolutely. I'm on every streaming platform as T two times capital T, the number two, the letter X, and then my YouTube self plug is T two X official. Oh yeah. You want them to subscribe, like, subscribe, like, you know, run it up for me. You can <laughs> okay. meet me over on Instagram. I am Tasia E Y E like your third eye. A M T A J H A. Oh yeah. Say Dang. less. <laughs> but so, okay, so I got her here today, y'all. Look at the cologne collection. It's growing. Okay, it's growing. And I got some over there, y'all. I got a whole bunch. So, what she's going to do today is whatever cologne you want to smell, you know what I'm saying? Go ahead whatever? and smell it. Whatever you want to smell. All right, I want to start with this one because it looks cool. Okay, that's Paco Rebond Invictus Platinum. I like it. You like that one? <laughs> what does it smell like? It smells like it's like I can't give you a like an item, but it uh, energy, I guess. It smells like handling business. It's <laughs> handling <laughs> business. Oh yeah, for sure. Okay. It's very masculine. I That's, like that. You like that? Yeah. All right. So I got a question for you. Okay. So seeing as how all these colognes you know what i'm saying it's supposed to quote unquote turn a woman on mm -hmm. what's a thing that a man can do to turn you off like what's some things that turn you off from a dude um a lot breathing existing talk no i'm just saying <laughs> <laughs> i was like jesus no um i think a turn off is a. Uh, men were too easy too easy yes like they just and i'm saying like easy in a way like then you'll just like you just met me and you just mm. want to be having raw sex with me and like doing all this weird stuff like that means you just out here doing that with everybody yeah. and now i'm not fucking with that like you have no patience i think that's a turn off so you feel like a dude uh, they got like maybe like low standards more so like yeah it yeah. makes it feel like like if you act like that with me you act like that with anybody and you can't be fucking with me oh you can't be messing with oh, we me cuss on here. oh okay <laughs> <laughs> You can't be fucking with me if you fuck with everybody. Oh yeah. What's another one then? Another turn off yeah. is um It could be a pet peeve too, like I just hate this shit. Oh when people when men think that because they have money that that makes them like so cool and awesome. Like I'm not yeah. saying don't have money. No, like, speak, your, your business, speak your speak your game. But like, it's just like if all you have to offer is money, you don't have a lot to offer. And you, so give me an example. A dude that just got some money. Like, what, like, like, what would they do? They just want to pull up on you. And they're, they're essentially trying. It's like it becomes transactional. Like, they're trying to buy access to you rather mm -hmm. than, like, actually have a connection and build a connection and get to know each other. Oh, yeah. It's like, hmm, pay to play. That's what they be on. Yeah. So, and, it, and it's hard for you to really take a dude serious like that? I don't take men seriously. Damn! <laughs> she said yeah, it's not I'm a not chance. I'm not even dating. Like I'm not even interested. Swear. No, literally. So 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 men just just lost. They just lost. It's not. It's not that they're no, because there are some great. There's some kings out there. Like don't get me wrong. Like, okay, okay. There's okay. some kings out there. But it's just like, who wants to spend so much time fishing through shit? You okay, know? okay. So like, you kind of wanna... just be put away and wait until one divine day it just happens. it just happens okay then say less all right smell some more stuff man. all right let's go um i don't know what are these it's like a revolver yeah yes it oh, is wow. the mother the mother of wanted line so that's a zaro wanted by night It 
It's not bad, but I wouldn't want my man wearing it. You wouldn't want your man wearing it? What's the vibe of you? Older. Older? Like? Like grandpa. Grandpa? Because <laughs> of the spiciness? <laughs> It's like, it is spicy. It's yeah. spicy. That's something for Pawpaw. Yeah, yeah. It smells like something. <laughs> <laughs> it smells like something a man would spray like after a workout when he needs to like stop at the gas station on his way home and he don't want to be smelling sweaty. What? Oh, so it's just something like. Just quick. Just a quick. quick refresher maybe, but not an all day. So it basically, is, it smelled a little cheap. It's not cheap. It doesn't smell cheap. <laughs> it smells old. <laughs> it just smells old. A little too mature for real. No, for real. It, it gives me like 50s years. 50 years 50 old. years, 50 years. Oh, yeah, your granddaddy. Your Cadillac. Great uncle. Man. Yeah, your grand <laughs> All right, grab some more, grab some more. Jesus sandals at the cookout. Jesus sandals, <laughs> no socks, toes off. Ooh, let's try this one. Ooh, I oh, think yeah, I'm gonna that, like this one. Oh, yeah. That's a Valentino. Momo, born in Rome. <sighs> I like this, it smells fresh. <laughs> it smells fresh? And it's like softer. It's not so bold. Oh yeah. Clean. That smells nice. Yeah. That I smells like nice. It. You would want your man to smell like that? Yeah, I like it. Oh yeah. But this one is the one I've been waiting to smell. Oh yeah. Time for tobacco veneer. Oops. Like that. <laughs> Wait, because the first thing I thought of, <laughs> this smells like a backwood. Tobacco and vanilla. It smells like a Russian cream. Tobacco and vanilla. <laughs> That's exactly what it is, yeah. If you like the smell of backwoods, Russian creams, this is your fragrance. Tobacco and vanilla. I wouldn't buy it for my man. Like, she wouldn't want somebody to smell like that. Sometimes I like buying men's fragrances for myself. More than, more than oh, it's time for more Good. That smelled good. Hey, that's one of my favorites. That's 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 the one. Uh, what I was like, he was smelling too good. It was irritating. Oh, really? That yeah, was it. Yeah, <laughs> just like, bro. Yeah, this is nice. Yeah. It's like an everyday scent. Like I wouldn't mind smelling this often. I like this. Like this that? is nice. <laughs> okay, these time I got no level. Some of, it, some of them might be empty though, but. No, this one's pretty cool. Okay. Oh yeah, Dolce Gabbana. What is that, Mysterious Nights? Yeah, yeah. I had to put a sticky note on the back of that. Like a baby shower. A baby shower? <laughs> this show angle right here. Like this side far. <laughs> I like this side for sure. But that's what you said baby shower though. Yeah, yeah. I don't really like it. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you about to be He was like, oh yeah, baby shower. I don't really I don't like really it though. Like it. <laughs> 
I was not expecting you to say that. VIP. Oh yeah, by Carolina Herrera. Two twelve. VIP oh, two twelve. Yeah, two twelve. Okay. Get me right. <laughs> VIP black. Oh, they got me right. Why didn't they tell them how to really say it, bro? <laughs> they be on my ass, huh? Gotta keep you accountable. Where's those <laughs> coffee beans? Oh, I see. Right there. Right. Gotta reset her palette. Yeah, man. Oh, this is very fresh. Oh, yeah, y'all. She told me everything she's saying in her songs. True. Back. Facts. She said when I was when I when she was in her song talking about doing that drive by, she was really doing that drive by. Facts. You know what I'm saying? Facts. I mean not facts for legal purposes. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, facts. right. Shh. Hush, yeah, yeah. She's everything was props for entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> hey for real. <laughs> and they do be saying that. They like, know, yeah. They're prosecuting people for lyrics these days. Yeah, they be like, uh they be like, uh Entertainment purposes only. Hell yeah. I haven't the video I just dropped yesterday, I have a warning on it, like all weapons and whatever mm -hmm. is props only. I like too. this. It smells super fresh. Mm -hmm. It's good. Yeah, it is. But it's, I still haven't found one that is like Just blowing the slice off. Try, try this one over here. This one? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah, she said it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, you like that one? Okay. Okay. Why though? I like it because it's like light. It's not, you know how sometimes when people spray a, a fragrance on them, it's like very overpowering. Yeah, yeah. And it takes away from like, could it even smell good because it's like too much? Yeah. This is like. Perfect. Yeah. That's actually like one of my favorites. Pocket Rebond with Million Pop on. It has like almost like a, it's like a sweetness to it, but it's not feminine, if that makes sense. Okay. I like it. You just I think, like it? I think this is the one. This the one? <laughs> Out of the ones I smell. Oh, oh wow, yeah. that's so cool. Oh, the robot one? So you can smell any one you want. Nothing. <laughs> I'm like. Oh, he was like, uh, where is it at? <laughs> All right. Nah, it's a nice bottle though. It's a nice bottle. What is my like grass? Yeah, like grass. <laughs> <laughs> like falling leaves. And acorns. It smells like something someone would wear to like a corn maze. Like a corn. Oh, swear to God. So if y'all going, you know what I'm saying? Apple picking. Yeah, like a fall day. Yeah. Put some of that on. All right. So I got another question. Mm -hmm. What's the What's your idea of a perfect date? Ooh, I love things that aren't dinner and drinks. So like going to like a sip and paint or like a pottery class or. Literally going to yoga. Mm -hmm. Someone will go to yoga with me. That's like top tier. Um, what if, what if the dude don't know how to do yoga? You gonna teach him? Well, that's what you're going. You don't have. It's just it's just moving your body. It's not like you're just doing what the instructor says. Oh okay okay. Yeah, okay. I always recommend going to yoga for men especially because y'all need that stress relief. <laughs> um, it's really a stress relief for real. What mind body and soul? Don't sleep on <laughs> yoga. <laughs> I love yoga. I'm going to a session tonight. But yeah, like doing something other than like dinner and drinks. That's so basic. It's so basic. What is and it? how do you even know you want to sit across a table with someone for an hour and a half? Like, what are we talking about if we just met? I don't know if I even mm -hmm. like you enough to do that. That low key is a different way to look at it. So, okay. So, seeing as how you got a lot of different date ideas, like, give us some more. Just riff a little bit. Because dudes probably need it. They're going to they gonna write this down. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So, yeah, not dinner or drinks. Or the movies. 
I would just say finding something literally to do or if it is like going to get food make it a place that like neither of you have been not like some basic spot that everybody is going yeah. to you know what I'm saying like actually take the time to find some stuff like I have a list for our area like yeah. of places that I'm gonna try then I just check them off I as swear. I go yeah, so, so what would you what would you find like like what you going to learn like what to do around like how do you is it the website Eventbrite 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 Groupon and then literally when I'm driving around if I see something or if I come across an ad on like Instagram or Facebook I'll just put it in my notes and be like okay this is happening around this time Sweet. but on Eventbrite there's like so much free stuff to do you just have to like Go register there. for it so you have your ticket but it's free you just show up huh but especially with fall coming, like, there's so many dates that you can do, like, mazes and apple picking, picking strawberries, like, literally anything other than dinner and drinks. Hey, y'all, y'all heard her, man, picking some strawberries. <laughs> that sounds like a really good date, honestly. Fact. So, speaking of date night, okay, so I got this fragrance, right, that a lot of people said, you know what I'm saying, they would wear on a date, you know what I'm saying, and it's this baby right here, I'm going to reach for it. It's called a Zorro the Most Wanted. Can you smell this from Dun dun dun. Yeah. People would love to see what you say about that. Let me make sure I'm all the way legit for this one. I like this. You like that? Yeah. Alright, what you like about it? What you like about it? It's like clean. It just smells so clean. It's like um my vocabulary for fragrances clearly there. No, I remember it's just describing the smell. Like it don't even get like a fragrance. Like things that just remind you of. <laughs> when I smell it, yeah. <laughs> when I smell it, it makes me think of like, you know, when you're like having it, sharing an intimate moment with someone and you're like, it's like some skin to skin maybe. And it makes me think of like, like in my head when I'm smelling this, I think of like body scaping with my hands. Oh, okay. You know what I'm talking about? Like, okay, yeah, okay. so like if you had, like if a man was wearing this shirt off, yeah, you know, all together right here. Like, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, okay, okay. So that, that's also something that you would wear. So that's, that's beyond date. That's the, uh, the after this is part. The, <laughs> this is what's going to get you at, past the date. <laughs> yeah, this is nice. You like that? I like this one. Okay, so now this is gonna be the last question of the day. Okay. Dun, dun, dun. So, you told us about things that turn you um, turn you off. A little bit of stuff that turns you on. Okay, perfect dates, all that. So, you know, as you can kind of see, it's like a pattern. It's like, okay, when you first meet the dude, how he can turn you on. And then when you take you on a date, now this is the closing. You know what I'm saying? It's closing. So, like, what are things that turn you on? The name, like, what's a perfect? After party experience, quote unquote, you know what I'm saying? Sexually wise, you know what I'm saying? How, how, what, what a dude gotta do to please you 100% the right way? Sexually? Sexually. We have, to have an, we have to have a connection outside of sexual attraction to each other. So I would say like um, actually being mentally stimulating. Cause like you can be physically attractive, but if you, I don't know, speaking for myself, if I'm physically attracted to you, but I'm not mentally attracted to you, I'm gonna psych myself out of having any sexual relations with you because I know that I'm not gonna get what I want from the experience because we're not tapped in like that. Yeah. So I would say literally just making it comfortable to be like have that friendship dynamic but also the attraction of each other. I think people skip right to oh well you're cute and I'm cute let's have sex but it's like yeah uh. I ain't gonna hold you well, I can't attest to that because like I think it's the older I get like the more if I don't really know you, I can't really do nothing with yeah, you. Yeah, because like, like I, 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 I sit like I, I literally just not get hard no more. It just stop. Like literally, I'm like, you're not gonna be talking like, about me like I ain't got a whippersnapper just because you weren't mentally stimulating. Yeah. Like don't play me like that. So I don't even put myself in those situations. Oh yeah, no, that's that's actually a good thing. So like, what would like what would what would you say is like the 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 most important thing that you would say like you would want to do with a dude? Like what would you say is like the most important thing that you would want to do with a dude? 
how he is in bed is more so just you, he just gotta be mentally stimulating. No, I wouldn't go so far. To say oh, that's that. not what you were saying. I don't <laughs> no. know. I said there's no possibility of even making it to the bedroom if we can't connect outside of our physical attraction. Okay, so what, okay, how about this? Like, once you get after that part, what is like get explicit? Like, tell everybody like what what dudes be fucking up on. That's why I re- that's why so, you're here. You know what I mean? Something um, a friend said to me years ago that has just stuck in my mind, oh my God, is that men will be masturbating in the pussy, literally. So it's like, you're not even, you're not even putting any effort into my pleasure. You're just literally jacking off in my vagina. Damn, that is like... So I think, mm. but that also has a lot to do with like the intuitiveness that a man has within himself. So I... So is you is you basically saying people would be too ordinary, I guess, or they're too lustful. It's like there's more to like the the things that you could do with sexual energy, especially if you're entering that exchange like with intention. Like, what we could come out of this two whole elevated people. Whoa. Like we, you know what I'm saying? We could <laughs> yeah. make some magic right now, but people don't want to actually you know lay a foundation for that. And I'm not saying like oh like everyone has to be in like this committed relationship and to to get to this, but it has to be some type of attraction or connection outside of just physical. Because you can teach people how to have sex with you. If, if a dude, like, told you, like, ah, can you do it like this, you're not even going to feel that way. You're like, all right. Yeah, like, isn't that the point of <laughs> together? Like, we're here to please each other. Like, oh, let's yeah. get it done. Oh, yeah. Okay, say less. <laughs> hey, y'all, y'all learning some good knowledge right here, man. So y'all don't got no yeah. excuse. You feel me? If I was y'all... You know what I'm saying? Watch this video. Take some notes. Cause she know what she's talking about. Okay, this this is the last fragrance I need you to smell. That was the last question. Okay. This is the last fragrance. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. Yo, I think y'all know what I'm gonna grab. Cause we gotta see what she say. This smells like intimate. <laughs> it smells like intimacy. Oh, I never think I got a smell. No, for real. <laughs> it's a whole vibe. You don't know the smell of intimacy? That's sad. Let me smell the bottle again. Yeah. Cause you know, I'm, I'm just like, I think I'm like the smartest unaware person ever. Like if you ask anybody, they'd be like, Chris, but you're not attached to those, those spirits. You know side. how like things bring like, like, okay. You can see something like we can see these, these you know the the branding of these bottles and everything like that, and that's one aspect of it. And then you know you have the touch, right. then you have the smell, and then you have your own like internal workings where you visualize what all of these things connect and make you think of. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um. And this I, is like. Do intimate. I smell intimate? What do I smell when I smell this? I smell like a. I think it is like an intimate, yeah, because it's like, Not like it, int- intimacy doesn't always have to be sexual either. Like a moment. Like a moment, yeah, like yeah, a, I call a it moments. Moment. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's just like a moment. Yeah. It's like when you're watching TV and then like the time stops in that frame. You know what I'm saying? Like this is what they're wearing. Flash it. So you like that? So out of all the fragrances that you smelled today in this video. Uh oh. What's the best one? What's your best one? Which one is really, if you kind of remember the bottle? I think it was. Blew your socks off. I don't remember which one it was, but it was one of these two. This was the one I did, right? Because I was like, this looks like a revolver. Oh yeah, but I remember it might have been this one then. No, that was the second one. That's the one you recommended. So, so you actually liked this one because you was like, uh, wait, said, was like it that. this one? No, this was the old man yeah. one. Oh my god, that's the old man. <laughs> I was like, one. so it had to be this one. Let me smell it again, though. <laughs> yeah, it's this one. Is this, I one? Like this one? Oh yeah, okay. So you like that a lot? That's a pocket revolver. It's just like it's um. Batman. It's just like clean across the board. 
I mean, they were most of them were pretty nice though. Like this one was, this one was good too. I like that one. I like that one. But this is like a nice. Wear versatile kind of yeah you could kind of wear it whenever and it was still green or that one that you said this one man there's so many i know <laughs> <laughs> this one was fire i don't know this one might get first place instead i'm gonna give this one first place uh, instead. Four? yeah this one definitely can deserve that top spot yeah top for noir extreme smell it again just so you can make sure yeah because this one was um that's what i was like oh i see why you were upset Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, for sure. That's a thing. Yeah, I like this. All right, y'all, y'all. She said that she, that time for noir stream is her favorite. Can you tell me your social media is one more time? The Instagram, Instagram. I'm on Instagram. I am Tasia E Y E like your third eye. A M T A J H A. Tap in, y'all. Tap in. Thank you so much for coming, y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. I'm gonna make her drop a YouTube video next week. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna get some work done. Yeah, so all right. jump over to my channel next week. Gotcha. <laughs> all right, y'all, take it easy. I'm selling that cake. Fuck all the talking and fuck all the talking and fuck all the walking. Got money to make. Fuck on a bitch and I don't do a day. Came off the streets and I'm paving my way. Yeah, you on top, but I'm counting your days. Yeah, you on top, but I'm counting your days. Came to the party with no gun. Left the party with a